Hi, my uh, my own children are Paradise Elementary students. They lost their school, but today we're hearing great hope that they're going to be reunited, um, not only with their friends but also with their teachers. So we're really hoping that we get to be back with Mrs. Levin and Mrs. Taylor, and wherever that may be, we will we will be there. We're very excited about this this hope and this start time. Could you share your name with us? Lisa Shaw. Lisa Shaw, great yeah. to meet you. Yeah, thank you. Um, so could you tell me a little bit about um, how were your kids born and raised in Paradise? They were born and raised in Paradise. We've lived um, in our home. We brought them home to the hospital, the home that we lived there for 15 years. Um, I work in Thermalito currently, so we had I had to go home to uh, get my children once the school evacuated. Um, so my husband happened to be in town, and we both raced to get our children. He got there first. We evacuated separately. He had the kids going down Clark. I had myself going down Skyway. Um, it was very all the stories that you heard about driving through fire, driving through flames. We did it. Um, it was scary. But we're we're happy to be here. We don't care about our home, but we want our community back. Yeah, so. you were talking about the sense of hope that you now have. Yes. Can you tell me? Do you think Paris is going to grow back stronger? And a little bit about that. I, I do. I think uh, if you talk to people from Paradise, they're Raleigh calls Paradise strong. They want to come back. They want to rebuild. They want to make it better. So uh, I definitely think they're coming back. Everybody's putting all their energy there. Um, we are. It's a community. It's a community. So yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. Perfect.